Do you also think that food technology and hotel management courses are similar? If so, need not to worry. Your buddy is up with the Mythbuster video. Let's understand this with the help of your most favorite tomato ketchup. If you're new to the channel, do subscribe for latest updates. Tons of tomatoes are produced every year nationwide. It is generally used like a vegetable despite being a fruit botanically. The role of food technology starts from very beginning that is selection of superior quality tomatoes containing high amount of total solid. Once the tomatoes are harvested, the biggest challenge in front of a food technologist is to minimize the post harvest losses which requires storage of harvested tomato in controlled condition which is achieved by maintaining suitable temperature and relative humidity along with many other minute details so as to prolong shelf life of such perishable commodities like tomato after evaluating the characteristics of food via sensory analysis proper ripened fruits are selected whereas the green ones blemished and overripe fruits are discarded fresh tomatoes are very refreshing and appetizing but cannot be stored for a longer period of time to avoid tomatoes from getting spoiled it is sometimes canned converted to puree or juice once the tomatoes or the puree is ready to be dispatched it is loaded in cold storage reefers which is then delivered to the factory site once these tomatoes enter the factory site major parameters such as total soluble solid known as tss volume of puree ph and color is checked at the entry point based on several specifications for tomato products laid down by fpo food product order which specifies minimum total soluble solid percentage and mold content in several tomato products so if in short we look at the processing details washed tomatoes undergoes various steps such as sorting trimming heating pulp extraction then it is cooked with one third quantity of sugar later spice bag is added and cooked until the volume is reduced to one third then spice bag is removed and end point is judged by checking tomato solids by hand refractometer it is advised not to use iron or copper equipments at any stage of processing also the equipments must be glass lined or made of stainless steel to prevent its spoilage and extend the shelf life certain preservatives are added then it is filled in bottles at 88 degrees celsius followed by crown corking then it is pasteurized cooled and stored at ambient temperature burger after burger fries after fries we all expect the same red shade of ketchup therefore consistency becomes an essential element quality check is the most essential step once the manufacturing process comes to an end this ensures a safe product to the ultimate consumer spectrophotometers are used to ensure the color consistency also total soluble solid and titrable acidity is checked under the guidelines laid down by food safety standards authority of india fssci you can also check it out for yourself by visiting www.fssci.gov.in under the section 12.0 of fruit and vegetable manual now there comes the role of iconic packaging it is done in glass bottles squeezable bottle pouches etc it protects the food commodity from external environment and for the purpose 
of transportation and storage it is beneficial it plays a major role in success or failure of sales of any product labels on the food can be used to attract potential buyers it also plays a key role these days as now all of us are more concerned about their health and are in search of the relevant products it provide important details such as list of ingredients net weight batch number manufacturer details details of added preservatives such as in this case it contains permitted class 2 preservatives as you can see on this packet it also contains license number provided by fssai nutrition labeling details such as energy protein carb sugar dietary fiber fat saturated fat trans fat and sodium content along with this it also contains use by date best before details storage details heat claims symbols such as tidy man vegetarian etc after winning all the battles ketchup bottle gets approved then it is packed and dispatched to various supermarkets hotels and restaurants for further use Some hotels and restaurants have their own traditional way of making ketchup for their daily use whereas others rely on the food industry for products such as ketchup mayonnaise chili sauce and various such condiments the list is never ending the place where the role of food technology ends is the time where the term hotel management comes into existence we all will agree to the fact that food is presented well then there is an appetite for consumption food technology ensures a safe product to its consumer but role of a chef is like a magician who not only makes it more palatable but also prepares a variety of different tasty dishes from the same ingredient along with working on different flavors and texture of food Now let us take a look at how these two courses differ academically. For a food technologist, main aim is to focus on various aspects of food technology, whereas in hotel industry, technical and general aspects of hotel management is the main aim. Coming down to the opportunities, a food technologist is having opportunities in various sector such as research and development production food safety officer quality assurance quality control new product development fci education sector sales and marketing sector also they can become an entrepreneur whereas on the other hand opportunities for people in hotel industry varies accordingly such as cruise and ships education sector entrepreneur hotels and mnc's national and international airlines catering operation and its management restaurants and obviously working as a chef food technologists are involved in production and processing of food basically from farm to the shelves of supermarkets whereas hotel management involves use of these finished products in making several cuisines such as Indian, continental, Thai, Mughlai, etc. The main aim of a food technologist is to enhance the shelf life of the food product, whereas hotel management aims at enhancing the palatability and presentation of various cuisines. Food industry has various standards that needs to be followed from start till end, that is from the point of sample collection to the final packaging of the product which are laid down by various regulatory bodies such as amount of preservative in any food or quantity of any flavor enhancer such as msg content in case of maggi 
So guys, that's it for today. I hope you all have enjoyed the video. For more such videos, do subscribe to Food Techno Buddy. Thank you all for watching. Stay home, stay safe. Take care. Bye.